On Tuesday of this week, North Korea successfully launched a spy satellite into space. That was 21 November. This video is a recording of Voice of Korea on 22 November, the Wednesday, when they announced the successful launch. As can be expected, the program is dominated by the launch. They spent most of their news bulletin talking about that. But I play clips here of the entire hour of the broadcast. It is in English, 11910 kilohertz. So you can hear the station sign on, some songs, the news, some music again, and the station sign off. Then I also play just a couple of clips from KBS World Radio from South Korea, also on the 22nd of November, just a little bit later, the same evening. Unfortunately, I missed the news bulletin. I tuned in too late, but their general program does not mention the launch at all. They speak about all kinds of other stuff and not the launch. So I think it's kind of historic, these two broadcasts, the opposing views from North Korea who launched the satellite and then South Korea, who seems to not mention it at all. This was at 1900 UTC, 2100 Central African time, my local time, on the Kenwood R1000 with the MLA 30 plus loop antenna. <laughs> This is Voice of Korea.
National Aerospace Technology Administration of the Bahara Focus Republic of Korea has established a new point KOS-31, loaded with the reconnaissance satellite Meridian 1, the force of a satellite launching guard in Chosen County, North Pinan Province, at 24 hours, 14 minutes, and a second on November 24th to 710 or 2020.
music in stage art presented by the art shows. The Diploma from Prizes for a while to a missing a concussion in its history. A lot of chapters were born at the time of the Jordan Hospital of Fire. This type of treatment were born at the local in the 6th of November, and we were manifest this day. A high-stepped treatment on this one for all guys, and the second in the third class was. And that's the end of the race. Don't be changing your path. Now she is in a dip and puts on a
president for Wimbledon, and also vice chair of the people of uh, the Republic of Korea All Party Parliamentary Group. We connect with him now, Mr. Hammond. Hello, and thank you for your time today. Good morning, and uh, good to meet you. I understand that you were present during President Yoon's speech before the British Parliament on Tuesday. Uh, what did you make of the speech? Yes, I was. It was, uh, it was a moment uh, of occasion. Um, the speech itself, I thought, was delivered uh, with warmth and with intelligence and insightfulness. Uh, the President spoke about the historic links between our two countries, in particular some of the help that Britain has given Korea over, over years, but now talking about our future together and our economic and cultural well, It's been a pleasure to have you on the show today. We've been speaking to Stephen and Anthony for Wimbledon. Thank you once again for your time. My pleasure. Welcome to the Korea 24 Stock and Forest Update. Composite stock price index gained 1.28 points or 0.05% on Wednesday. Close today, 2,500 points, 7-0. Certainly good to see Korea perform so well ahead of that. That's where we're going to wrap it up for today's career trending. Thank you for bringing us those stories, Daniel, and we'll see you next time. Thank you so much for having me.